What's going on guys and welcome to today's video. I just got to the gym. Today's video is going to be all of my favorite shoulder exercises. So these are the exercises that I find the most effective to give you the best pump, everybody wants a good pump, and the most effective to hit either the front delt, the medial delt, and well mainly we're just gonna focus on the front delt and the medial delt because I usually hit my rear delts on back day. Give this video a thumbs up if you guys want me to do more videos like this for every single body part. Let's do it. What is going on you guys and welcome to today's video. I'm super excited to be just compiling all of my favorite shoulder workouts or exercises into one video for you guys. Like I said, these are just the ones that I enjoy doing the most that give me the best pump and that I just, I love them. I love them so much. Shoulders is one of my favorite body parts to train. So let's just get right into it with this grueling dumbbell lateral raise tricep. So you're gonna be doing 10 behind the back lateral raises, 10 traditional, just neutral lateral raises, and then 10 with your elbows bent. When you're doing the elbows bent, make sure that your elbows are actually leading the way and stopping once they are in line with your shoulders. So next up, we're doing a single arm Arnold press. And this is actually the one single arm movement that I just love doing along with actually the hanging lateral raise. You guys will see that after, but I really enjoy doing the Arnold press single arm. I think that it's important to be doing single arm and single leg movements. Um, with dumbbells, it's a little less likely that your weaker side will be overcompensated by your stronger side, but it is super, super important for that reason, just to make sure that your guys' uh, muscular symmetry is balanced. So make sure that you are incorporating single arm and single leg movements. Next up, we're going to be doing a barbell press combo. So this is the combo. You're going to be doing 10 barbell overhead press, just the traditional way. And then you're going to be doing 10 behind the neck. Wow, this one is totally killer. The behind the neck ones get you every single time. Rock it out, girl. Pound it out. Come on, you got this. <laughs> All right, next up, you guys have been seeing this a lot in my shoulder workouts, but it's the plate front raise. Now, I just love incorporating the plate on back day or shoulder day. I think it's a great like distance apart. Everything about it, I really like hitting my front delts with the plate raise doing front raises or even overhead front raises where you bring it all the way over top. Next, we're gonna be doing the dumbbell front raise with static hold. So the static holds look easy, but they are not. So you wanna keep that arm out as straight as possible. Do all of your reps with the one arm and then move on to the next. You can do static raises with you know front raises, lateral raises, or even shoulder press. Wow, just another way of frying your muscles, your fast twitch, slow twitch muscle fibers. It's gonna fry them all. All right, of course I had to incorporate just the traditional dumbbell shoulder press. I really like doing this exercise with high rep. So you'll always see me doing reps about 15 to 20, maybe even 25. It's just one that I really love to pound out and get in an awesome burn with. This barbell clean and press is something that I like to do as a burnout, which means I like to do it at the end of my shoulder workouts. So it's basically like an upright row and then you're pushing your elbows underneath it and doing an overhead press. So there's a lot going on in that movement and it is definitely just going to fry your shoulders at the end of the workout. Like I said, a great way to burn them out. And to finish this video off, we're going to be doing some hanging cable lateral raises. I really love this exercise just for an extra added range of motion as you're hanging a little bit from the cables creating a 40 degree angle and some extra added resistance from the cables itself. So if you guys like this video, don't forget to subscribe so you can catch more just like it. And if you're interested in trying out my 12 week training program, you can click right here.